This is a practice carillon that I designed and built this year. It has a keyboard of 50 batons laid out in the North American standard, with each baton controlling one bell, as well as a pedal board of 23 pedals. Here's the view of the instrument from the back, and let's have a look at how it's constructed and how it works. Up front are a bunch of aluminum tubes, which are held loosely in place with a bunch of fishing lines, allowing them to vibrate freely and produce a sweet sound. When a key is pressed, a little aluminum striker moves forwards and hits the bell, and we can see that again from the side. The strikers are connected to wooden squares and counterweights to give a more realistic feel, and each mechanism is pulled upwards by a steel wire that runs over a pulley and then descends downwards towards the keys. When each key is pressed, it pulls down the wire and causes the bell to sound. The 23 lowest keys have a further wire hanging down, which connects into the pedal action. Each one of these levers converts the motion of a pedal into the motion of a key. Another row of cables connects these levers to the pedals. Since the pedals are spaced much more widely than the keys, a series of pulleys fans out the wires before they meet up with the pedals. This action ensures that when a pedal is pressed with the foot, the corresponding key goes down as if played by the hands. The instrument has a bit of a strange sound that I'm still working on improving, but it's been very useful for practice, and I'll show you what it sounds like right now.